welcome back to my channel if you've never seen my face before i'm the miss nicole marie today we are going to be doing a warby parker try on for primarily yeah actually only sunglasses so i as you saw if you saw my christmas haul then i you know that i got a warby parker um gift card and i finally ordered some sunglasses to try out and see how they look. I've got the box here ready to open. I haven't even looked at it yet. So we're gonna go through this and try them on together. So if you enjoy this video, please subscribe it down below, like the little thumbs up button down below as well. And let's get straight on into today's video. We're gonna open up the box here and the Warby Parker box kind of just says, good things await you. And something already flew out and this is what it looks like and it has my little gift receipt thanks for shopping so much for ordering a home try on and we have all of the sunglasses in here and what fell out of the box is looks like a little newspaper almost your home try on handbook we offer everything you need for happier eyes at a price that leaves you with money in your pocket from designer quality glasses and contacts to eye exams and vision tests. So they offer a lot more than I had thought. I knew that they offered sunglasses and glasses, but I didn't realize that they did contacts and eye exams as well. So how to send back, you just, you have five days to try on the sunglasses or glasses that you get, and then you affix your prepaid label to the outside of the box and you send it back. So. It, this comes with a label already, so it's easy to return. And then you can just go on the website and click the one that you want to keep, I believe. And then well, it tells you how do they fit, and it's like a little checklist. And they have like a little crossword puzzle on the back, so kind of cute. So going back to this, let's start trying them on. I'm gonna just pick one out here and this is the Laurel Tea Rose Fade. So these are the Laurel glasses and I'll put like a little screenshot of what it looks like on the website here as well so you can see like a little comparison and let's just try these on. How do they look? I know my ears are like kind of crooked. I can feel that they are, I feel like they look crooked, but obviously I won't be able to tell until I edit the video. So let me know what, um, what you guys like. We'll label this one as number one. And this is the Laurel, like I said, in the tea rose color. And I did get all of these in a size medium or narrow depending on the options that they had because I do have a pretty small face. So here's option number one, the Laurel. Let's see if we like this one. Okay, actually I'm gonna put them back on. I found a little handheld mirror so I can actually see myself as we're doing this. So, ooh, I kinda like it. I'm gonna like try not to put this in front of the camera, but I like the shape of them. I like that they don't necessarily touch my cheeks down here because um, I find that I always get like a line where my makeup is and it kind of rubs off. So I like that. I like the color of them. I don't think they're too big for my face, but again, this is option number one and you guys vote for your favorite down below. Right. So let's open up this second pair here. This is Griffin in the color Seaweed Crystal with Konic. Can't tell, the word's a little faded. All right. This one's kind of got like a green tint to it and like the sides are a little brownish black, I believe. All right, this is option number, oops. Option number two, the Griffin see how I look okay they're a little similar but not as like I don't know they seem more basic I feel like I like 
the look of it is not overpowering my face or anything like that so I think I like it but it also is kind of like a normal sunglass style where I could find pretty much anywhere so and I keep hitting this because it like it goes pretty far at the back so like you can almost see it right here which is probably not a great look and I keep like accidentally hitting it off so the little long in the sides so option number two the grip in let's try option number three get a ziploc bag all right so this one is the duran durand in the color rose water i think this is the one that i was like think i was gonna like the best so let's see how it looks Ooh, yeah they're definitely more narrow which is probably good for my face get my hair out of the way yeah they definitely like hug right there which is nice for me and ooh, they definitely look a little small actually I'm not sure how I feel about them I feel like I almost look like one of the um, three blind mice if that rings a bell with you guys I have no idea they also are a little long in the back as well. I do have really thin, fine hair, so, you I mean, it might be just like an issue I have with most sunglasses, but it really annoys me. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm not sure actually about this one. This is option number three, Durand, so let me know what you guys think. Do I look like the three blind mice? Maybe. All right, next option here is the Sydney, and I got this in the color Chai Crystal Fade. Go back to the... So, option number four. Oh, this one feels narrow, too. Okay, not as narrow as the one before. Feels good. Let's see how it looks. Okay, this is, I think, a little bit better than the last one. Um, I don't know. It's kind of got like a two-toned color here, which a lot of their options do have. And, I don't know, I like it. I don't know if I'm in love with it, but it's definitely a good contender. So, it also yep has that little tail at the end, which is just a little bit too long right there. But, it seems like most of theirs are like that. But, it's probably just because I have super thin hair, so. Option number four, this is the Sydney. Let's try the last option, number five. And this one is Barkley, and it's in the color Antique Shale Fade. Ooh, this one's interesting. I don't know if you can see that. It's got like the little, almost like marbling effect or something. And Oh, it does have like a little bit of two-toned. It has the marbling on top and then just like a plain, almost brown color at the bottom. So let's try this one on. Definitely a bit wider right here. Still pretty long in the back. Let's see how it looks. All right, they look like kind of normal sunglasses except for they have like the special coloring, which is nice. It doesn't seem like too overpowering on my face, but it is definitely one of the bigger ones um, compared to the others. So this one is Barkley. We'll say it's number five. And let me know what you guys think. Let me do like a little snippet of like all the different sunglasses side by side here so you can compare one, two, three, four, and five. So let me know what you guys' vote down below. And yeah, that is pretty much it for this. Um, I will definitely see how easy the shipping is. I'm pretty sure it'll be a breeze. Um, they already gave me the label, so all I have to do is slap it on the box and send it back. So it should be pretty easy, and I love that you can actually try these on without having to purchase them first. They do also have a store, but they only have like two stores in all of Orlando. One is in the Millennium millennia mall and the other is in winter park and i have visited the winter park location but they do have a lot of their just regular glass glasses and their frames for those 
I didn't see a whole lot of sunglasses there, so I wasn't sure exactly how that worked. And going through the website, it definitely divided out easier, saying that these are sunglasses and these are just glasses frames. So I just went on and I ordered them to try at home. And then I just made a video for you guys. So if you've been wondering how Warby Parker works, that is essentially how it works. It's pretty simple. And that is everything I have for this video. Please vote down below which one you like the best because I'm very indecisive and sunglasses and glasses are something that I find really hard to find a good pair that look good for me. So let me know your guys' vote down below and don't forget to subscribe, like the video if you did indeed like it, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!